It is, I, I think we're in, a, in an incredible time, like, because we, not, we don't just have access, especially in rural communities, like, you have access to the people around you, and generally there's like this consensus in everything that people do. Right. It's stronger, I think, in rural communities because of the way that, that people are, which can be a really solid foundational thing for their for a community and bring them really close together, but it also means that everybody has a kind of group think in some circumstances. So if you're capable of doing things like breaking patterns, which you can teach yourself to do, there's uh, books on creativity by Edward de Bono that talk about it, the idea of how breaking patterns will teach you to be able to move into new spaces and think about new things, and take those things and be like, you can really, like, you can, you can become a leader, and the reason that you can do it, specifically with the web, is because the web is not your community. It is not your geographic location. So you can go anywhere and listen to anyone talk about any subject with any opinion that they want or that they have. And which means it allows you to get out of your normal habitat and almost like act as if you're someone else and think about things in a different way and come back to your community and bring the things that you've learned. And I think that's an amazingly powerful thing. So that's it. There needs to be some kind of foundational person. There needs to be somebody who is like, and I am doing this often for my community, I love my community, and so I'm bringing things from outside and bringing them in. You know what I mean? It's that, I think that's the one thing that any community needs is kind of a, a kind of champion. Seth Godin would call them a, a linchpin, somebody who's really out there and just like not afraid to take those risks and will do it for the organization or will do it for the community. Everybody needs one, the problem is nobody wants to be one. Everybody wants somebody else to step up to the plate. But everyone also wants an exceptional, great, cool life. You can't have both. Decide. Do you want to step out of the, into the limelight? Do you want to be somebody that people look up to? And I mean, those are the people who take risks. The other side are people that do the same thing that they've always done. And that's fine if that's what you want to be. But I think there's too many people who want to do great things, who want to do amazing stuff, but fear holds them back. And so you've got to figure that out for yourself, whoever that happens to be, you know, thinking about it.